Hey everyone, um, so obviously from the title of this video, um, you are interested in a really short, sharp um, review, try on haul from the website slash brand Shein. I think that's how you say it, I'm not too sure. I have purchased a few items from there, uh, only three dresses, so just three. It's going to be a very short little haul. I thought it would be handy as I watched so many of these videos before um, I actually purchased anything from this website because you're just not too sure with places like this. They're more of like a wholesale website. Things are so cheap. You don't know what the quality is going to be like, what the fit will be like, things like that. So I've only bought three things. I'm just going to show you them today. Um, and hopefully this can help if you're thinking about making any purchases from there. And only really guarantee that the items that I bought specifically um, will be of that same quality. Because um, I know there's a few things on there where they post multiple uh, there's like multiple different sellers selling the exact same thing. So I can't tell you out of that which would be best or worst. Um, but these three items that I have today, um, they are all actually really good quality and I'm very impressed with them. And for what I paid and everything, I'll try them on for you um, and give you a little bit of a review. And then I'll also put like the price and I'll put the links below if anyone wants to have a look at that too. Um, Alright everyone, so this is the first item that I got. Um, it is this kind of pale, dusty pink uh, bodycon dress with these really, really puffy um, sleeves. They're kind of like a, I don't know what you would call it, a really thin kind of mesh material. Um, I absolutely love this and I am super happy with how this looks. I did see this recommended from a video that I watched on YouTube actually, I've forgotten what her name is, um, but she's really good with all um, reviews of like Shein and cheaper things, she says some uh, lookbooks too, I might pop her down below if anyone's interested in looking too. I've bought this one, I can't remember the price but I'll put it somewhere on the screen for you. So yeah, this is a really nice pink colour, I believe it also came in a lilac and a blue and I think black potentially as well. It's made quite well I would say. Um, that's it there from the side um, and the back has a long line zip going down um, and I'll come a bit closer so you can see the sleeves. Okay now here uh, you can see the puffy sleeves. Um, I absolutely love them. Um, you can obviously like puff them up a little bit or flatten them down however you'd like. Um, I did buy this dress kind of in mind with going to the races. Um, however, due to everything that's happening at the moment, that got cancelled. So I have this dress and another one that I'll try on in a minute, um, which were both going to be kind of options for that. However, I guess I'll just save them for another time. Like I said, I'm not too mad about it because the quality of these are actually quite nice. This is a very stretchy material too. Um, and I like the length. It's not too short. Um, and it doesn't ride up when you walk either, which is nice. Um, but yeah, so I'll show you these ones. I would highly recommend this dress. It's just so beautiful. Um, and yeah. Okay, now this next dress is like a little blazer dress. Um, I think it is absolutely adorable. It is made of a very stretchy black kind of polyester material. I love the sleeves, how they have the slits here. So to put your arms up, obviously that's all open. There is also a little slit in the bottom of the dress here. Um, it comes fully up, so it's not actually sewn past these buttons. I didn't mention before, but that pink dress that I had on, I bought the size extra small. Uh, this one I bought in a size small. Now, the only thing about this one is it is quite big for me. Um, I don't have a big chest, so there is a lot of extra room here. And in the back, as you might be able to see, I have just bulldog clipped it for now. Um, because there's quite a bit of excess material um, and obviously I haven't gotten around to taking it in yet on the sides but that'll be quite easy because there's two seams there. Once again I think this one is really good quality too. 
it's just so cute i love the sleeves just make it look so much nicer as well um just to get up close now don't mind a bit of my bra there like i said i don't have enough boob to fill this out so i'm just wearing something underneath for now um it also has some little shoulder pads up here to give a nice shape once again i just love this uh you can see the shiny gold detail on the buttons there there isn't a zipper in this one to put on but as the material is very very stretchy and as this is a bit of a bigger size for me um, I don't think that it requires a zipper to get into or out of it is very easy to just slip over your head especially because of this deep plunging neckline as well all right now just bear with me guys um, this is the last dress is very over the top um, and roughly but oh it's just so gorgeous and I love it and I just really want somewhere to wear it but I have nowhere to go at the moment. Well, I mean no one has anywhere to go at the moment so I can't stand here whinging. But yeah, I bought it in mind for the races. Um, obviously I will keep it and wear it for something. Uh, for the price, I'm not angry at all. So this here, this is the final dress. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. Um, I don't think I can flaunt Flaunt? No. Flaunt? No. What's the word? Oh my god, I can't remember. Fault! I don't, I don't think I could fault the making of this dress at all. It's just lovely. Um, it's got these gigantic puffy sleeves um, to go with it. They're elastic, so you just slip your arms in. And look at them, they're so ruffly and beautiful. Obviously, you can just kind of ruffle them up however you like. Um, it's a little strapless piece here. It's a nice length as well. I don't know what to call this material. It is very kind of slippery. A slippery kind of like curtain material. I don't want to call this dress a curtain. <laughs> Um, I don't know what to call it, um, but it's got that on top which creates that kind of ruffle looking effect through the whole dress and like the ruching down the side too, which is really, really lovely. I believe that's also in the back um, as it has a built-in zipper, um, so it's all ruched down the middle as well. Underneath, it does have a black lining as well, if you can see that, um, so it's not see-through whatsoever. Um, I believe I bought this in a size small as well and it fits like a glove. Yeah, I just want to wear this. I just want to wear this and have drinks somewhere and look really fancy. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm going crazy in here. guys like I said it was a really short sharp shiny and quick video um, I did only have those three dresses to review um, like I said I really love all of them need somewhere to wear them <laughs> I just want to say in general with Shein they didn't take that long to get here I know it did get held up a bit due to the delays of postage because of um, the virus and everything uh, I think I received them within a month probably within three weeks, I'd say, from China to Australia. And then with the sizing as well, I believe it's quite true to size, um, which was good because I do get very worried with those websites as well because I know sometimes the um, Asian sizing can be a bit small sometimes. Um, but in this case, like I said, I got that pink dress in a extra small. And that fits really, really well. And I think I got the other two black dresses in a small. And they fit really, really well too. Highly recommend them. Um, they're great quality for the price that you pay. I can't complain whatsoever. Um, like I said, I will link the three dresses that I bought down below. Um, and hopefully, if I've worked out how to do this properly, I will have the prices for the dresses while I tried them on. <laughs> if not, I'll put that down below too. Um, but yeah, if you're looking to order something from Shein, I don't think it's a waste of money. I think in total, I got those three dresses for, I 
think it was just over a hundred dollars or just under a hundred dollars um that's everything from me today guys uh so definitely check shian out if you haven't before if you got, i mean you got nothing else to do in this time anyway i think this is the most online shopping i've done um which is really not great but i am still working so i still am getting paid so at least that's a plus but yeah uh if you like the video or want to see anything more like this give me a like or let me know down in the comments below bye